Happy Monday, everybody. So yesterday, like I'm sure most of you, I was watching the Super Bowl, and before the game, we heard America the Beautiful sung. And I thought, I remember hearing that in church, but it's not actually in our Lutheran service book. It's in a couple other hymnals though, which um, made me look it up. And, and so here is what it's all about. The lyrics to America the Beautiful were written by Catherine Lee Bates, and the music was written by choir master and organist Samuel A. Ward. This was in 1910. Well, actually the hymn tune was written in 1882 and finally paired with the poetry America the Beautiful in 1910. Which brings up an interesting idea. Most pieces of poetry have a rhythmic pattern even without music. And most music has a rhythmic pattern attached to its phrase structure. So if you open up a hymnal and look to the bottom right corner, you'll see this. And it's either a set of numbers or couple letters signifying numbers. In this case, it's CMD, meaning common meter duple, which is shorthand for 868686, or a phrase of eight syllables followed by six syllables, followed by eight syllables, followed by six syllables, etc. So then you turn to our metrical index in the back of our hymnal, and you look for CMD all the way down here. And all the hymns listed, you can superimpose over the melody of America the Beautiful and it will line up perfect. So while it's arguable whether America the Beautiful is appropriate for church, we can still use the hymn tune and church appropriate lyrics, combine them and make something that we definitely can use. So open up your hymnal and sing along and uh, see if it works. <laughs> 